Okay, I feel bad. Uh, I ordered some Jordans off the internet. I can say where, but apparently they were fake. I got the Jordan 5 Retros, and let's take a look at the box. That's pretty bad quality to me. As you can tell, the box is all smashed up and stuff, and that's not on the real 5 box. And the shoes barely even fit in the box, too. So here they are. As you can see, Jumpman has a butt crack right there. Uh, his hand is wider than his head. And there, that looks like a stick man. And that's totally poorly made. Jumpman's blurry again, and he's too thick. This part right here is pretty real. So is uh this part. But other than that, it's totally fake. I mean, you can tell like the in this part right here is all thin and stuff. I mean, look at that then. I mean, it's like ridiculous. Well, there now it's better, but uh, the laces are very very thin, and the sole like the clear part is not supposed to be like that color. It's kind of this is kind of like a cream color. Um, on the real one, it's supposed to be almost like blue. Um, the 23 is not stitched very well. I don't know if you can see it, but um, oh, and on the back, that uh, uh, that's supposed to be white and not black. And Look at the R. It looks like a P. Horrible. Well, again, these are only like 85 bucks, so not a big loss. Well, 80 bucks, I guess. Here's the other one. So, uh, I will be getting some real Jordans next week. I got them from Finish Line. They are the Jordan B Loyals. Uh, I will make a review of them. Um, and that will be my last pair of fake shoes. I will tell you that. It's my first and last. So, yep.